Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and to another reaction video. Okay, just giving you a heads up right off the bat, this is probably going to be a little bit shorter than a lot of my uh, reactions. Um, I have... I have a situation <laughs> where my jaw sometimes pops out in ways it's not supposed to and it has been doing that repeatedly over the last few days so it's it's very uh sensitive right now and I don't really want that to happen again right now so I'm gonna try to talk less than usual unfortunately um but I didn't want to put this off any longer because I promised you guys a couple of weeks ago that I would get this reaction up soon and life got in the way and it hasn't been up so we're gonna push through and today we're going to be reacting to side by side um another piece by diana and kudanova um accompanied by brandon stone so this was new like i said uh put online a couple of weeks ago and i had another song of hers performance that i had planned on reacting to the same exact day that it actually was published, so this one got pushed back a little bit. Um, but now we're ready to go, and I'm excited to check this out. Um, their last collaboration was uh, very lovely, um, different from a lot of what I've seen from her, so I'm wondering if this is going to be more along those lines. Uh, yeah, so let's check it out together. Here we go. <clears throat> Hmm. It's interesting, guys. Close up on necklaces. Close up on necklaces. Oh, he's singing too this time. Oh, this is a duet. I thought last time he was just on the piano, so. Look at me and tell me what you see. Be honest now to me and feel. Can we love again if the heart is broken? Can we breathe again if the soul is frozen? She's going up into a pretty high register for her. Can we love again? Forever side by side. I like that little build up. Side by side. There she goes again, like much higher than I'm used to hearing from her. Okay. Many different ways you have to go until you know right That's the kind of deep thing that I'm usually uh, expecting to hear from her. Side by side together Heaven please, heaven please Just make it happen We will love again Oh look at Oh my god She looks so pretty goes again they're very good uh harmony between their voices <laughs> it almost feels like a gospel song in this part even though it's a love song Well, 
that was lovely. Um, so yeah, that was side by side, um, Diana and Kudanova and Brandon Stone. Like I said at the beginning of the video, guys, when he first started singing, I was not actually anticipating that this was going to be a full-on duet with both of them singing because um, the last video that they posted of them together, um, which was her cover of What a Wonderful World, he was also, you know, he was there and he was accompanying her on piano. So I was kind of anticipating a similar situation, but no, he was uh, doing a duet with her and he's got quite the voice himself too. I was really impressed. Um, you know, I imagine it's probably a difficult thing to do a duet with someone who has such a, a presence the way that she does and, and such a strong voice. Um, but he did a great job and together like their their voices the harmonies that they were making were quite beautiful um the song itself is this an original song of theirs um or is this a cover of a song that i just don't know you guys please do let me know because i'm i've never heard this before so i'm curious if it's an original song that that they have put out there into the world or if this is a cover of a song I just have never heard of but it works very well with their voices I was I was really interested because there was multiple times throughout the song where she was going up into a much higher register that I'm used to hearing from her you know she has such a a kind of rich voice um and that she can she could get really down into some deep registers that not a lot of women will actually uh, be able to get to. But this time, at some of the points in the song, she was the one doing the higher uh, part. But he And he was going a little bit lower, which was interesting and, and definitely surprised me. But of course, you did a fantastic job, as always. Um, it was also very interesting, not at the exact, not at the exact end, but like the section closing in on the end, the last minute or so. There was parts where I was getting the feeling that it almost had like a, I think I mentioned this, um, like a gospel song kind of feeling um, in the way that they were kind of playing off of each other, which is interesting to me because this is clearly, this is a love song. This is it's not a gospel song in any way, shape or form, but it, it just kind of had that feeling to me. And maybe it was just the combination of the harmonies themselves, the way that they were going back and forth together, um, and the ways that they were kind of <laughs> like looking so happy and also moving around with their bodies. And I don't know, it just reminded me of that. So um, I don't know, maybe I'm crazy. You guys will have to let me know if anybody saw anything similarities to that at all, um, other than me in this. But the song itself was very lovely. Um, like I said, I'm really curious to know if it's an original piece of theirs. Um, this also is similar to their other video they posted in the sense that this is a full-on, like, produced music video, um, which most of what I've seen from her, other than the other one, of course, has been live performances. So this is dramatically different from that. Um, this is a, a full-on music video, studio-produced version of the song, and then their going back and forth between different scenes so quite different but i think also you could you could still see um some similarities between the design aesthetic choices um in her live performances and those that she has here as well um carrying over there's some elements of nature even though in parts of this video both of them are kind of mostly in black and white but at even in those sections, they have like the doves in the background kind of tying it into that. And then they have the section where it jumps into where she's wearing this lovely like white dress with like colorful flowers on it. And they're sitting in front of a window that goes out into like a very lovely green garden-y space. Um, so yeah, even in, in a produced video where most of the color scheme is black and white, she's still kind of able to get that in there, which I think is really just important um because like to me it seems like that's very much her aesthetic is tied to nature in a lot of ways but all right guys i think i'm gonna wrap this up jaw's really starting to hurt and i'm hoping that 
you're able to actually hear um, what I'm saying because I know I'm not opening my mouth as much as usual when I talk. Um, but it was a lovely song. I'm glad I got to check it out. And as always, if you guys have recommendations, please let me know or other comments, questions, leave them down below. Thank you so much for joining me and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.